So you guys, I saw this video and you literally take a bandana, you fold it in half and then quarters. Is that quarters? Thirds? Okay. I have two rubber bands here. They're just <laughs> These two rubber bands here, they don't even match. And I'm gonna put them onto the ends like this. One, two, and then right about there. And you're gonna take one of the ends and stuff the other one inside. And that's why you want to do the thirds. You don't wanna do half because your thing will come apart right here. And shove it inside and then fold it back up. You're gonna take these ends, right? And put it on your face. So this is the bandana. Please excuse my quarantine look because you know, Quarantine. Here is the rubber bands. I'm gonna shove this. My kids are screaming and I've asked them like eight times to shut up. So you wanna make sure that where you're folding these pieces in that it's centered because you don't want it to come out. So it's centered. I'm gonna pull these rubber bands out like this. Guys, it's the coolest trick. And it's adjustable because you can move this, you can widen the bandana. So technically it can only go so wide from what you shoved in here can be adjustable. Hopefully you don't have a ginormous face. How freaking cool. How cool is that you guys? Make your own masks. Yay! You also can get bandanas at Walmart for, I don't know, I think a few bucks safe and make your own masks. Um, it saves a lot of headache for everybody that's making them. I have been making them. I've made over 400 and I'm just to the breaking point where I, it sucks. Everybody needs one now and I totally get it. Um, but it just also sucks that they have relied on homemakers or seamstresses to be able to provide the entire, look at that. There's a mask right there to provide the whole world with these. And so please don't feel stressed out um, and don't feel like your grandparents or anybody are in jeopardy. Make your own mask. 